Hi, my name is Bruce Nye, and this is my first demo video for Review Board. My current project is to add a different backend for the patient stiff algorithm. First of all, I want to start off by introducing patient stiff algorithm. Unlike Myers, which is the algorithm Review Board is currently using, patient stiff algorithm does a full scan of both versions of the file first and then match up unique lines they have in common. Therefore, an interesting matches such as extra lines and curly braces will be ignored. We can understand this as patient's algorithm improves the diff result by actively seeking out the interesting lines before diffing. Also, I want to clarify that patient's algorithm is not an entirely different algorithm by itself. So my plan is to apply a traditional diff algorithm review board currently uses after the file is nicely, nicely sliced up by the patient's diff algorithm. Now let's jump into the demo. Here I provided two um, sample files which shows a lot of um, common things that might happen during uh, code control, uh, version control. So c.txt is still going to be compared against d.txt. In d.txt, we can see the first three line is the same as 3.txt, and then the fourth line is a duplicate of the second line. And we can also see that the end line, freedom and edge, is switched against each other um, from c.txt. And now let's see how the patient step algorithm handles it. The first step, we will read the two files to be compared. And as we can see, this uh, each line is read as a talk token and put inside of a big list. The second step is to find the slice class, which is the equivalent as a code block. And I initialize the code block uh, as the whole file by its, uh, itself. So as we can see, the code block A is the first line to the last eighth line, which is the last line of my c.txt. And these are the elements. And my file B has nine lines from the first line to the ninth line. And this is the elements in the list. And the third step, we will find matches in content between A and B that are unique. The keyword is unique here. So for example, banana wouldn't be matched with the banana and block A because there are two bananas. And now let's see the result. So as we can see, we have apple, um, cat, dog, edge, freedom, and then the last empty line. And then, by uh, I use patient sort algorithm to find the best way to slice code blocks. Um, the challenging part here is since edge and freedom is switched, I cannot divide them nicely to two code blocks. So I should prioritize on um, keeping the block as as um, big as possible. So in this case, I will match. Um, freedom here to the freedom here. And let's see the result after patient sort. So we can see we, uh, we decide to slice on apple, cat, dog, and freedom, which makes sense because apple is the first three and then dog by itself and then lastly freedom. Last but not least, I call patient stiff uh, uh, recursively, um, and each e in each iteration, the patient stiff will try to um, divide up the current slice, and then the new slice will be called patient stiff on itself again until the slice has reached its minimum. And now let's see the final result.
So the final result, we see apple is paired by itself, banana is, and cat is paired as a group, and then the dog here is paired with banana and dog, and in the end, edge freedom is paired with the freedom here, and the last edge is left out. Now let's see it on a real code example. So I created two Python files. And let's see how well it works. As we can see, it divided up each line in the file into elements and stored it in a list. And then it finds all the unique matches. And then it uses patience sort algorithm to find what's the best way to do the slicing. And then in the end, we will have um, blocks that are and that code block that should be considered the same as uh, what we expected. That's the end of the demo. Thank you.